freaking go. Let's freaking go. Please tell me I was recording. That's a big eight pointer. That's a big wide eight pointer. Oh man. Oh my goodness, bro. That's the big wide eight pointer. That deer's like 22 inches wide. We got pictures of him one day. Just one day we got pictures of him. It was like two weeks ago. Well guys, it's November 12th, um, it's been an awesome morning as you can see. <laughs> um, this is a deer that we didn't have a name for. Um, this is actually a farm that we just picked up a couple weeks ago and we had two good bucks out here. This was one of them um, and when he came in this morning, um, I could hear him crashing through some stuff and looked and he was kind of running through a thicket. Um, just, you know, head bouncing, horns bouncing, and I could tell how wide he was. I knew it was, knew it was the wide eight, and so, um, you know, really, really happy with this, this deer. It's actually my first deer with my 30-06, um, my first buck with my 30-06, and so, um, made for a fun hunt. It was 76 degrees yesterday. It was 43 this morning. Um. 8 to 10 mile an hour sustained winds most of the morning and uh, had them up on their feet. So um, it's been a tough season. I lost my father in law um, about three weeks ago. Uh, last year I lost my grandfather. Two weeks after I lost him, I killed my Ohio deer. And then three weeks after losing my father in law, I'm able to put down this beautiful wide eight pointer. So um, it's been a rough year here in North Carolina. I uh, had a rough start to the year, had a lot of distractions throughout the year, but um, acorns have been falling like crazy. It's been abnormally warm, and, uh, and so for the, the first big cold front to come through in November, it worked out great. So thank you guys so much for watching Beyond the Mount. Sorry it took us a while to bring you an episode this year, but uh, glad to be able to put one on on the channel for you so y'all stick with us man we got more deer to hunt more deer to kill so see y'all